okay, okay. I hear you guys in the comments loud and clear. So you guys won. This is what I did. I changed our bed back on the longer wall. Cleaned the dresser off. I think um, I'm gonna go get to Walmart and fill this up with these little icy picks. I think that's really cute in that vase. But I took my perfume off and I'm just gonna place it in, oh there you go, in the um, my glam room so this is how it's looking it looks so empty in here <laughs> so that's where I need to put my perfume up and then I took the mirror down that was over here and placed it there in between the closet and the bathroom and I like it because when I'm looking in the bed it's like I'm looking outside and that's why I really wanted to leave my bed this way so I can see outdoor through this window but now that I have the mirror, I'm fine with it. So this is how it's looking. I put the bench over here. Now, this is the picture that I took down. I think I'm going to place it because it really, really needs something over here. So I think I'm going to place it on this wall. Let me hang it and then you guys, again, in the comments, let me know. Um, and then window treatment. Definitely going to hang some here, I guess. You hang one panel over here. Oh, I'm trying to make me a lamp, a floor lamp. But anywho, this is it. Look at this is what I did to look at this pillow I made. Uh, that is the wall, the valance, the window valance. I was gonna make two, but I just made it a completely beaded pillow. It looked like something that you would have at a wedding or something, right? It's beautiful so I just went on and and see originally because I was gonna make it into two I had cut it but I ended up having to put it back together to make it one complete pillow so you'll see the rhinestones are following the cut line so that's why these rhinestones are here because that's the way I had cut it because it was supposed to be two different pillows but you will never know the rhinestone just bring some more sparkle all right so this is my bed and if I'm in my bed you can see the mirror like that so this is it all right only thing I have to work on I get some drapery hung I guess and so, so, since I have two windows I guess I would need a two packs two four i need four panels basically is what i'm saying i love my dresser without anything on it that looks beautiful with the, just a candle and those orchids i love it so simple and clean uh, yeah those perfume bottles were taken over and then this is my favorite metallic blanket Alrighty, so this is it it's small chic and to the point. Okay, this is pretty funny. This is my curtains here, and look at how short they are so good thing I have two two sets I'm gonna go ahead and try to connect them so they will flow down to the floor they are just hanging <laughs> that's pretty funny this is the before <laughs> you see how short the um, drapes are the curtains and this is how it looks extended big difference right then I'm gonna try to figure out how to maybe blend the seam a little better but that's how it looks with it added on there all 
Okay. all right you guys i am so so happy about how everything is turning out here in our bedroom it looks absolutely beautiful i love it i love it i love it so much you guys it's still a work in progress again you know we have to get um nightstands and lamps and then we will be done i'm not doing anything else i think it's absolutely simple and beautiful i'm working on the finishing up my curtains i just got those hung up and i need to finish working on this bench to get it recovered other than that we are on the home stretch look what i done to my curtains so i had some trim left and so i added and these curtains um i just got them home goods for 20 bucks I ended up getting two packs and I did have to I thought I was gonna be able to put one so I need to go get one more pack for the other side because these are not matching curtains actually these are what I already had from Germany so I just put them there just because they are similar but they're not similar these hang so much better because these are actually soft velvet these are really 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 pretty and with the rhinestones it's so beautiful I don't know if it'll show you okay maybe you'll see it but I hung them from the curtain rods so you can see the rhinestone coming down I'm needing to figure out what I want to put right here because it's just so just blah yeah, that's what I've been working on. So that's why I said this is a work in progress. And then I had these little ties um, in my room in Germany. And so this is why I attach the additional curtains. You see how I made them go to the floor? Because if not, they would have <laughs> stopped right here. Um, so I am working on disguising that. So I think that will work. Little crystal branch. I think it goes on like christmas decorations or something but last year i picked it up around this time when i was in germany but nonetheless here you go um i have our led lights up above our bed it's so awesome especially since i don't have a lamp over here right now i use that at night we just sit here and with the strips on there i'm gonna cut the light off so you can see of course it's daytime but it's not gonna reflect and i am absolutely loving as i in the bed i don't know if you see it this color green um which is like this color i think that's going to be my accent for winter this i've been seeing it i've been trying to use this color green for a very long time but it's so and this is flannel that i'm burning oh well i can't show you but you can probably see it right here this is the color that i want to use for my room and here is my beautiful orchid i love it here on the mirror dresser mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 